Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mood. Here we have interesting exponential equation 2 to the power x plus 4 to the power x over 2 to the power x equal to 5. If you know an answer, if you feel an answer, write your suggestion in a comment and try to solve it by yourself. So, there are three methods how to solve this. I wanted to show you two real quick methods and the third one method is using logarithm. So, if you're interested in it, of course, you can solve it by yourself using logarithm. So, first method. How to solve it, interesting method one. How to solve this? Of course, we can use a little bit trick right here. I write it in a different way, this on the left. Of course, I can write it as 2 to the power x over 2 to the power x plus 4 to the power x over 2 to the power x equal to 5. I think you understand me, because if we have, for example, I write a different thing. If we have, for example, 3 plus 4 over, for example, 7, can write it as 3 over 7 plus 4 over 7. Same denominator and of course we can d divide this and this by our denominator. So nothing hard. And as a result we will have 1 right here, 2 to the power x over 2 to the power x. And right here I can simplify this a little bit, writing in one parenthesis, so we will have 4 over 2 raised to the power x equal to 5. Really good, really good equation, nothing hard, just bring this one on the right, so we will have right here, of course, we will have 2 to the power x equal to 1, bring on the right, we will have 4, and x, of course, equal to 2. This is the fastest method, but I want to show you a real quick second method how to solve this method. Okay. We have a situation like that. We don't need these 2 to the power x in our denominator, so of course we can multiply in both sides by these 2 to the power x, and as a result we will have only our nominator on the left equal to 5 times 2 to the power x. Nothing hard, just multiplying both sides by 2 to the power x. So, what we're going to do next? Of course, we can bring these 5 times 2 to the power x on the left, so we'll have 2 to the power x plus 4 to the power x, and minus 5 times 2 to the power x equal to 0. 4 to the power x, write it at first, and what are we going to do next? 2 to the power x minus 5 times 2 to the power x. So, of course, we'll have something like x minus 5x, so it will be 4x, but in our case x is 2 to the power x, so it will be equal to minus 4 times 2 to the power x equal to 0. Okay, we can write this 4 as 2 times 2. 2 times 2 to the power x minus 4 times 2 to the power x equal to 0. If we have a situation like that, so the same, the basis, the number raised to the power x, and we have in our parentheses we have a product, so we bring we raise this and this to the power x. So we'll have 2 to the power x times 2 to the power x minus 4 times 2 to the power x equal to 0. As you can see right here, we have 2 to the power x and 2 to the power x. So we can factor out it as a common. So we'll have 2 to the power x and in parentheses, of course, we will have our 1, 2 to the power x, and minus 4 equal to 0. Real good case because we have a product and of course the first root 2 to the power x equal to 0. This equation does not have roots because this x doesn't matter what x, this cannot be equal to 0. And the second case 2 to the power x minus 4 equal to 0 and 2 to the power x equal to 4. x equal to the same as right here, something like that. The second method is a little bit longer and a little bit harder because you need to know uh, more properties, more power properties. This is the fastest method. So the second, the third method is the method with logarithm. This is the longest one, but of course you can improve your log skills. So if you're interested in this, of course you can solve it in a comment, you can write your answer in a comment, 
And this is our third method, how to solve this x equal to 2. This is our solution. If you agree with this method, if you disagree, maybe you have the first method, it will be really interesting to read your answer in a comment. So thank you for watching, thank you for subscribing, thank you for putting thumbs up. I, I watch it, I really appreciate it, and thank you so much. Thank you for watching, see you in the next videos.